All right, welcome back, everybody. This is Roy McQueen from NC Tech Lucians. And yeah, we are moving along here. And now we're covering the accelerometer. And what that is, that is a motion sensor that detects the change in movement relative to the current position. You know, it detects the 3D movements. It can also detect the 3D movements along the Y, the X and Y, and Z axis. So, um, if you're just not watching, the adding phone gap plug-in video gives you more details about getting set up and how to add a plug-in to your project. But for those of you that have been following along, we're going to just jump right in. I'm not going to show you how to install the plug-in. Well, I might, but I'm not going to go into details. If you want to go deep, if you need details, it's the video before this one. So. I created a separate HTML page called Accelerometer and with the basic HTML markup that we've been using this is how this is what we're going to be using uh, now let's go to the docs and get the command to install the plugin from the command line remember to move inside the root of your app folder where the plugin folder is located at Now let's just add the feature inside the configuration file. So now as we scroll down of the doc, in the docs, we're in the docs looking at the docs. So now as we scroll down, it gives you some examples on how to use this feature. Now this example will alert the acceleration of the X, Y, and Z, and also give you a, a timestamp. So let's go ahead. I'm gonna go ahead and show you this. So boom, that's pretty simple right there. So you can use these values to get creative using the accelerometer um, inside of your application, inside of your app, you're inside of your applications, and make you can make some interesting applications. All right, guys. So I'm, I'm uh, I think we're gonna cover one more video because it's, it makes no sense to going over all of these different APIs. You know, I just want to get you guys started. Once you know how to set up a couple of them, then you can go ahead and go through the docs yourself and set up the other ones for homework so I'm gonna do one more I think one more or yeah I think one more video and then um, then I'm gonna let you guys have it so I'll see you in the next video